the same lolly lady. <laughs> Keeping the car together is, is the plan, and then see what happens at the finish. <laughs> a bit of moisture out there, that's been a little bit easier on tyres. Yeah, easier on tyres. The grip level in here was very variable, so that made it a bit exciting. But uh, apart from that, it's good. And the forest, it's like being back in Wales. <laughs> let's, let's have a look at the watch in the day, see where I was. We've just got to keep doing our thing and stay out of trouble. So, um, yeah, we're just over halfway today in kilometres, so. Okay, we're into day five, we're in Dunedin and we've come from Kurao to Dunedin this afternoon. And you can think, well, not much happened, except Jeff Judd managed to take 50 seconds out of Vince Bristow. Nothing changed much in the order. That is until we got almost to the last K of the last stage on the day, when John Spencer, the Australian, in the gorgeous Nissan 240RS X works car, managed to roll it, but still recorded a time, second fastest time of that stage and we think he's still in fourth place, has accumulated no penalties, and we'll be back tomorrow morning when we head for Invercargill. Half a K to the timing marker. This is a car that John Spencer has not had for long. We know from talking to him that he absolutely loves it. And it's a car with a real history. It's a full works car. And one that Tony Teasdale was able to win the national championship in in New Zealand a few years ago. He purchased it recently, as we said, and he just wants to keep it pristine. So he's going to have a job on his hands to get it back in good nick. What did we do? Oh, the last corner just hung up a bit on me. Very last corner. Oh. Um, very good out of the control, yeah, eh? Yeah, if you let it roll through.